So, I'm visiting my friend's Paul studio. And uh, this is the painter himself. You can see Hello. very authentic with his clothing. And we're going to do a fast, fast tour through his studio. We picked some um, paintings that we liked more than others, but we like all of them. And okay, now you have to turn around and see this beautifully huge one of the sea. Paul, how big is it? It's uh, one meter by 173. Wow, it's really, really big. For a big living room, it would be fantastic. And also, I don't want to step on anything, but I see those two. They are, they are still in progress. That they are progress, that's what Paul says. I would take them as they are, but anyways, okay. I, I trust okay, okay. the artist. But they might get better with a little touch of this and that. You know? Okay, a little maybe, touch. Maybe they get worse, it could be the case. <laughs> but that you never know. <laughs> So, this is the flowers, which is, I think, they're lovely. And you said you're going to finish them or just add something and uh, show us how you do it? Yeah, I think the horizon might, might be spiced up just a little bit. Okay, so I'll just walk around a little bit more because I love this city one. Uh, and Paul just added just a little bit of spice, he said. How do you spice it? <laughs> like Carrie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it, need, it needs some. Uh, just, yes. just, uh, just uh, a little bit. A little more, more depth in the rise. I might change it later, but who knows? Yeah. Well, I might the just inspiration, leave it as it is. the inspiration hits, and this one is one of my favorites, as you can see. Paul, was it inspired by what? Do you want to play a little bit? Yeah, he's a cool guy. We are, we have fun. <laughs> yeah. The windmill is not, not too bad either. Oh, and the windmills. How did we forget? The windmills and the Golden Gate Bridge. And more flowers here. Anything, when if you want to say anything, Paul, just please, please. Well, no, no, you're, you're the better talking than me. Uh, well, he's very humble, this one. Oh, but we was, the, must do ah, the, yes, the yes, water yes. thing. Yes, the so this uh, is an abstract and uh, we decided that it could be hang like this and this is and way it's a seascape yeah seascape is a good definition but if you're bored of the seascape yeah you swap it around and you see the mountains and the water yes and you can keep turning it around paul just said that he outside, has to sign it both twice. ways <laughs> If so desired. <laughs> if so desired, he'll sign it both ways. And this is what, a lily? No, I think it's a Swiss mountain flower. Beautiful. One of my friends mentioned it. I don't know the flower as a Swiss mountain flower, but it could okay. be. It yeah. could be. Edelweiss? Huh? Edelweiss. Edelweiss. Hey, like don't call it Edelweiss. Can we sing it? it? Okay. That sounds marvelous. So we are just walking a little bit. As you see, there's lots of stuff here in the studio. But uh, so we'll do a little bit more. These are the, with this I, I call just kind of faces, maybe people. Well, they have bodies underneath. Yeah. Uh, torsos, torsos. 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 We call it torsos. Torsos. Facial there's torsos. And this is also very big, like that one of the sea. And it's like it's what? Even one, bigger, one, one meter 22 by one meter 73. Yeah, huge. Also to put in a very big living room, I would say. Uh, and this one I love because it's the seven chakras. And the last, which is my absolute favorite <laughs> because I love doors. Yeah. Okay, hallelujah. Is the Chinese door. So this is the beautiful studio. This is the handsome painter. Oh my God, you make me shy now. <laughs> and that's it. Huh? So contact me if there's anything you really fancy. And I'll ask Paul for pricing and how to send it, whatever, whatever you, you ask for. Okay? Enjoy. You can watch it again and again. Edit it. Okay. Huh? I think we're done, no? I, I think that's it. I mean, it can get more uh, authentic 